Okay, so now that we're in my schedule, let's see what we can do with the enrollments that you can access from here. Let's say that I want to see my course enrollment in the biology class. So I can click on the icon that shows the what looks like people and it gets you right to the class roster. And here's my and here's my class roster. And it shows that there are, um, the class had a capacity of 26 and there are 25 enrolled. You can see in the class roster, you can see their names, uh, the grade basis, um, the number of units they're getting, the, the program that they're enrolled in, their level and their status. And you can see in this course already a couple of students have withdrawn. Now, um, let's say you want to contact all the students. You want to send out an email blast to all the students and the way you do that, you scroll down and you click on the button notify all students okay so uh, this box comes up send notification okay and uh, it's going to send uh, an e the email message that you're going to type in the text box to all the students in the class when you click on that it's uh, um, it sends out the notification. It sends an email to their boxes uh, in the hostess email. Okay, it's going to. Uh, it's assuming they're using their hostess email. It's very important that you tell uh, your students to use the hostess email uh, to receive messages from you through CUNY First to communicate. To, uh, you know, with you through CUNY First, they need to use their hostess email. And so they should uh, make sure they have a hostess email account or they're accessing their hostess email account and that it's clear. Now, it's very important uh, that when you navigate around uh, CUNY First uh, that you use the navigation uh, links. Now, I want to go back to the class roster. Okay, so uh, one way to get back to the class roster is to click on the class roster tab that's at the top of the page and it brings me back to the class roster okay now uh, now I want to send individual uh, uh, notifications to certain students maybe warnings you know, or maybe congratulations they're doing well uh, in uh, in the course so far You can click on the notify checkboxes of individual students and then at the bottom click on the button notify selected students to send them the notifications okay so this time the email is just going to go to those students those particular students that you selected